Welcome to the tutorial on World Science. When you enter the World Science Network, you will enter a world where you can learn, write, share, research. You can simply search the world. If you need help on the keywords, you can choose a community, for example, neurosurgery, where the, the terms used to describe that community uh, quickly uh, are available for your use. You can type in the term uh, at your disposal and search. Let's type in the word trigeminal neuralgia, a type of facial pain, and we'll search the system for, for that term. Once that's done, uh, as you can see, a couple of articles come up on the topic. You can click on them. You can read the article and uh, in its standard format, as one can do uh, and has been able to do for a century, or you can ask direct questions of the work. For example, describe the patient group, ask the question. This is a format that's never been before available to the world. If you want to know who uh, funded this research, ask the question. If you wanted to know something else, simply ask the question. And in version one, the commonest questions that anyone would want to know from a scientific article are listed for you. This powerful tool will enable people to do research much more efficiently and in a greatly targeted way. Other features will allow the uh, researcher or user to uh, access the mathematical data. Now let's enter the system as a as a more sophisticated user and once you have access uh, just type in your email address and your own password and log in. This now goes from the Global Knowledge Network to the Global Knowledge Network of a person as you can see at the top and this is your home page. It lists your interests across the different communities again papers that you wish to have pushed to you um, manuscripts that you may be writing in either draft format or are already published where you can change them, delete them, and so on. You can manage your papers here. Review articles that you may have to do if you're a reviewer and articles that could be in draft format or in current submission. Let's start a new manuscript by clicking on the Start New Manuscript button. This leads to the Manuscript Foundations page. You enter your title. You choose a community of science, let's say medicine, the different sub-communities of medicine show up so that the system knows where you are. The different elements of neurosurgery, for example, neurotrauma, pain, come up. And the five different types of reports, case reports, clinical reports, clinical trials, laboratory reports, which are more generic in format, and review articles. It already knows that you're an author, so you are the primary author right now. But you can add authors or choose previous collaborators, create new authors, add their disclosure information including both the work they did on the article did they perform the research for example and any disclosure which automatically populates the disclosure section later on rather than choose random keywords that you think of interest to the community you will be asked to choose keywords from a drop down menu this menu represents the keyword listings of the community of neurosurgery if you see words that are not here you can you can submit those uh, to the network and they will be added quickly Level of evidence must be chosen. For example, this would be an article uh, as a case series. And help all the way through the network is in multiple languages. So to understand the level of evidence, help is written for you. If you're interested in reading that in Chinese, it's available. Japanese, Spanish, Portuguese, German, Arabic, French, Korean, it's all there to help you. Let's now begin writing. The different elements of the paper and the right manuscript component include the abstract, introduction, methods, results, discussion, acknowledgments. Rather than write a blank abstract, an abstract has eight questions. What is the background? What is the purpose of this study? Describe what you did. Describe the patient group. Describe the main findings, the main limitation, the main conclusion, and the importance of the findings and how they will be used by others. And all you simply need to do is click on one of the boxes and enter your response which can be one sentence to as long as you want there's no limit but all of these now are the different components and again searchable components of an article let's enter an existing article that's being written in draft format on the trigeminal neurology topic here is the abstract uh, background uh, the purpose of the study the patient group and so on when you preview all of these components they're all added up to look like an abstract uh, as they exist right there the methods will ask you about review board approval or funding. Since this is a clinical report, it'll ask you about patient criteria, important features, 
the evaluation methodology and the statistical tests used. All of this information should be entered and audited later on to see if you've missed anything to create the ultimate article that will be of greatest value to the world community. The, resul the results ask you to focus on your work and discuss those appropriately. References are added in different formats and then you can enter these into the article either simply by putting the numbers into the text or clicking on the tools button under each question. Tables can be in the standard format. You can upload a table as you have done likely for, for other articles. But this data is flat. It's not combinable. A new concept called the data share enables you to share your data with the world. So here's a data share on the patient characteristics of this study. This is data that can be combinable, mathematically used by others to create articles that are much more powerful, including higher numbers of, of study subjects. So this is a pain article on trigeminal neuralgia. All the variables that are important in trigeminal neuralgia are there. Statistics can be raw numbers, percentages, averages, and if units are appropriate, you can choose that. You add this to the column, click on Update Data Share, and then at the bottom under Summary, you will see the list of the entities you have chosen and simply enter the numerical data. This is now in the system for living use. Click on Vascular, and the attributes important in vascular neurosurgery are listed. Here are aneurysms and the variables associated with aneurysm type procedures, presentations, rupture, size, and so on are present for you. We believe this tool will be one of the most valuable and exciting components of, of the World Science Network. Let's go back to writing. You can upload figures and do it uh, in a standard way. Um, you can use JPEGs, TIFFs, or different kinds of figures. Here's a figure that is a line drawing that's been uploaded um, into the network. By clicking on the Tools box under any one of the box sections in the Abstract Methods results, for example, you will then place the figure into that component of the paper. To work offline, when not connected to the Internet, click on the Offline button. You can email the current version of the paper to yourself for use. Uploading figures and returning to the, to the manuscript. You can either take the, the, the article out and submit it to an existing journal or have it reviewed internally within World Science for what we believe is, is, is the, an outstanding peer-reviewed process. Let's show you what that looks like. The article for review um, is accessed by the reviewer, overseen by the editor. You can either the reviewer can read the manuscript in the standard format and make comments. But a more efficient and more powerful way would be to review the article inside the article. So by reviewing all sections, the article is opened up, and one sees the question, the text of what the author has written, and then within the box, the reviewer can can enter their review comments. The editor will see the multiple reviews and the author will see these reviews and can directly address the comments or repair the article right on top of the review. So it's not a matter of interpreting the reviewers comments and figuring out where to uh, best uh, modify the work but directly do that. And For the first time the peer review process can be studied uh, because the author reviewer interaction is direct and suitable for uh, measurement. We believe this will add to the credibility of science and create outstanding new opportunities. So now we're in the Knowledge Network of you and your home page will show your interests, uh, review that ne needs to be done, your manuscripts, the advisory and editorial board across different disciplines is an outstanding array of individuals who are intellectually engaged in world science. We encourage you to sign up for the beta testing of the, of the system by clicking on, on this link. Uh, you'll enter some personal information. A password will be sent to you, and you can start collaborative writing and testing the system and tell us uh, on improvements. This is a living environment, and world science is rapidly responsive to your various needs. This is the most powerful scientific writing tool ever created for your reports that allows you to do tremendous uh, things with credible, scientific, peer-reviewed information. Again, entering the world of radiation oncology as a user will bring up a set of terms to help you search the world of radiation oncology uh, in a more sophisticated way 
to learn what you want to know. World science empowers every person involved in the scientific process from the author to the end researcher who could be a high school student doing their homework uh, or a sophisticated researcher doing a PhD thesis. Uh, corporate interaction um, is novel, facilitating um, the function of the network. We encourage you to contact us um, with your ideas and if you would like to be involved and to utilizing the beta invitation of the system to begin to use world science.